Now, I hope I ain't too loud. So I'm, I'm making it my effort in, in my journey, in my time. I got what? Okay, some of this money, and I'm taking my camera, and I'm going down there, and you, ladies and gentlemen, will have the freedom to see what comes about with this situation. Okay? You will have the opportunity. Because I make you a solemn promise that I'm on it. A bunch. And again, I am not being ugly, but I'm aggravated. You know, if it's in my reach, if it's in these hands to help, then I got to do it. I mean, who, who is going to help? Who's going to help the old people, or the young people for that matter, that won't help, that are crying out for help, that don't want to be run over by some... And i got to tell you, I'm trying to be kind here. See, I have to balance I have to balance what I read, what I know and understand, and I have to hold my tongue because the fact of the business is that I'm still a human being. I don't live in the Spirit, okay? I'm supposed to walk in the Spirit and not fulfill the lust of the flesh, but i got to tell you, everything in me that, that my tongue has said in terms of, of foul language wants to say it about these people that have done what they've done to this individual, okay? And I'd ask another question before I leave today. I don't know how many churches are in this Flathead Valley that we're supposed to live in here up in Montana, but I'm wondering how many of them have even made an effort to do anything about it. You know, at least, at least Stuart Rhodes is on it. He met the guy when he was speaking down somewhere, and he met the guy and he embraced the guy because guess what? Stuart Rhodes has a heart. It hit him in the heart where it belongs. And you know what? It hit me when I found out about it where it belongs. And you know what? If we don't start at one doorstep, listen to me, if we don't start at one doorstep to make a difference, we won't have any doorsteps to step on in the end. It'll be nothing. And I'm not talking about save a nation here. I'm not talking about uh, constitution stuff here. I'm talking about, by gosh, I'm talking about the truth and the fact of the business is that old people are being mowed over and ran over by some dictatorship judge and by some, well, I, I got to be kind. I got to, and, mm, well, I'll tell you about her later, okay? The lady involved in the situation, I'll tell you about her lady uh, later. Uh, the fact of the business is this. It seems to me, listen to me and hear me clearly, and I hope this sounds okay on the recording because it needs to get out. It seems to me that if I wait, and I have not waited, I've tried to do all I know to do, but it seems to me if I wait until something like this comes to my doorstep, you ready for this? then how can I have the protection of the Holy Spirit upon me if I won't help and be a good Samaritan to the other? Oh, do I sit back? Do I get in a gopher hole and do nothing? I don't think so. I don't think so. So ladies and gentlemen, know this and know this well. I make you a promise and a vow before, before God, before the Creator of the universe that I'm going. And whatever I can do, I'm doing it to help this man. And I'm videoing every bit of it, not for my not for my edification, but for you to see just how, listen to me, the system of the United States of America works. It's going to be a sad case. Now, I will give you some great news because uh, last year I, yeah, mm-hmm, I know some people in Sanders County, in Plains, Montana, and Trout Creek, and a lot of other places. Oh yeah. See, I know a lot of people. And guess what the sheriff told the feds? Yeah. The sheriff told the feds to go bump a stump that he wasn't going there and changing the locks and doing nothing. Bring the feds in because he ain't doing it. And I thank that sheriff of Sanders County for being a man of conviction and a man that would stand up and say, I ain't doing it. See? 
So anyway, I'm out of time. I've went over. Yeah, y'all, y'all can just you know look up and do your article stuff and 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 do your research on this guy. It just ain't right. It uh, it just ain't right. It just ain't right. But anyway, hey, I want y'all to have a uh, a glorious day. I'm fixing to sign off because I got to get ready to preach the word tonight. I'll see y'all later. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being here.